Hello everyone. Welcome to my channel Best of PowerPoint and in this video I'll be teaching you an amazing intro text animation effect to amaze your audiences. Let's have a look what we will be creating today. So this effect can look amazing for your intro slides and it gives a sci-fi kind of look to your presentation. Guys, this animation is for intermediate users. However, I will try my best to explain it in a simpler manner so that even beginners can understand it. So open your PowerPoint slide and change its background color to black. Write your desired text which you want to animate. I would recommend you to type the same text as mine so that it becomes easier for you to follow and understand. So kindly write best of PowerPoint and change the font to OCRA extended. This is a common font and should be pre-installed on your system. However, if it's not there, you can watch my other video in which I have explained how to download and install new fonts in PowerPoint. I will provide the link in the description box below. All right. Let me change the text color to green and now what I will do is right click the text box and select save as picture and save it in your system. Now delete this text box and insert your recently saved picture in your slide. And now here comes the most crucial part of this animation effect. What I will do is I will crop each and every alphabet and separate them from each other. First of all, copy this picture by pressing Ctrl plus C so that it gets saved in the clipboard. Next, go to the format tab and hit the crop button. Crop the first alphabet like this. Now paste the picture by pressing Ctrl plus V and now crop the second alphabet. In a similar manner, crop all the alphabets so that they become separate individual pictures. I will fast forward this process a little bit. So after you are done with the cropping process, here comes another crucial step of this animation. I request you to kindly observe me carefully and follow me along. Insert a rectangle shape in the slide such that it covers the first alphabet like this. Change its fill color as same of the text that is green and select the outline color as no outline. Now I'm going to animate this shape. Follow me carefully. The first animation will be the appear entrance effect. Then click on add animation and add pulse animation effect. The third animation effect will be applied not to this rectangle shape but instead to the alphabet below it. So while holding the shift key, place the shape a little below the alphabet, select the alphabet picture and add appear entrance effect to it. Now place back the shape to its original position. Select the shape, click on add animation and then more motion paths. Select the right motion path and click OK. Adjust the right end of the path so that it gets placed over the second alphabet like this. The final animation effect which we will add to the shape is the disappear exit effect. All right. So that's all for the effects and now it's time to adjust their properties. Guys, I know this seems to be a lot difficult right now, but it's not like that as we have to do all this stuff only for the first shape and for the rest, we can simply copy paste. So open the animation pane, right click the first animation effect and select start with previous. Right click the second effect and select start after previous. For the third and the fourth effect, 
select start with previous and for the last effect select start after previous now select the fourth effect that is the last second effect and set its duration time to 0.25 seconds similarly select the second effect and change its duration to 0.20 seconds that's all now you only need to copy paste the shape and all the effects applied will automatically get copied along with it for duplicating the shape you can simply click and drag your mouse button while holding control and shift keys together let me explain the concept of holding the control and shift keys together clicking and dragging while holding the control key ensures duplication on of the object while the shift key ensures that it gets aligned properly so you can see that the animation effects have also been copied along with it however the third effect which we had applied to the alphabet beneath the shape has not been copied only four effects have been copied whereas we had applied five effects previously so we need to just select the alphabet under the shape and add appear entrance effect to it in the animations pane place this effect under the pulse animation effect and select start with previous that's it now you need to repeat the steps for the other alphabets as well however there is a difference when it comes to the alphabet which is placed after a space than the previous alphabet that is at the beginning of the new word like here after t alphabet there's a space and then comes the o alphabet so let me reach there first and then i'll explain you the process So here the only thing which you have to do is simply click and drag the motion path so that it ends at the O alphabet. Also for the next alphabet that is the F alphabet you need to again adjust and shorten this motion path so that it ends at the F alphabet only. Kindly follow me along and observe the steps carefully. That's the only thing which you need to take care of and the rest you can simply repeat the steps. And one last thing is that when you reach the last alphabet, the very last one, simply delete the motion path effect for it since there is no other al alphabet left now in the slide. And that's all. Let's play the slideshow and your sci-fi intro text animation effect is ready to amaze your audiences. You all will be glad to know that my next video would be top 5 animation effects and tricks for PowerPoint 2019. This is the second version of my previous top 5 effects video which is close to 1 million views right now. 
so kindly stay tuned for my upcoming videos and there's a lot lot cool stuff on the way so that's it guys i hope that this video was helpful to you please like and share the video and please don't forget to hit the subscribe button thanks for watching and see you in my next video